This video will show you how to update your Building Link database by adding and removing occupants. Use Quick Search on the top left to find the unit you need to update. You will land on the Unit Overview page. From there, click on the Occupants tab at the top. If a tenant is moving out of the unit, use the red Remove Occupant button on the right hand side. This makes their profile inactive. You'll see a message box open up. Just click OK to complete the action. Your previous tenant has now been archived, and their details can be viewed by selecting Include Deactivated Occupants at the top of the page. There is also the option to reactivate them if need be. To add your new tenant, click the green Add Occupant button. You'll need to fill in their first and last name details, then click Select Occupant Type and select Tenant, or another option if applicable. Click Suggest Username to assign a login name for them, and over on the right you're able to enter the contact details available to you. If needed, their notification preferences can be adjusted at this stage. Keep in mind that they can update this themselves once they've logged in. However, if you're setting up a user who doesn't plan to live in the unit, such as a real estate agent, they would probably prefer not to receive most of these notifications. Once you've entered all relevant info, click Save Changes, or use the option to save changes and add another occupant if you have more than one tenant to enter for this unit. Once you've saved the tenant, you'll be returned to the Occupants tab. You'll now need to email the new tenant their login details. You can do this by clicking the green Email Login Info button to the right. If they don't have an email address, you can click Print Login Info instead. Check out our other videos for more tips on using Building Link.